in this scenario, we're going to cover how to report your drone when it was stolen or lost. Now, the first thing you're going to want to do is go to stolen drone info and you want to click on report a lost drone. We're not going to report a drone found because we haven't come across one. So let's report a lost drone. We know that in this case, it's highly likely it was stolen. If it was missing, it would have just drifted away or maybe been caught in some trees, but it was stolen from our vehicle. We know that it was a DJI FPV, so we're going to select DJI. We're going to select FPV. We're going to say that it still had a red tag on the frame. And that's the details of that drone. Next, we're going to put in the serial number. I do have that here, and if I need help finding it, I can visit the help docs. I can also visit the DJI website or my local aviation authority to find out what the serial number would have been, but it's also on the box, and if you recorded it, some of the pictures from your drone. Now, in terms of the software ID, that could be the drone's name that you've assigned it. In this case, I had named it the Icy Banana, so I know that will still be in the system. I don't remember the flight controller serial number, or the controller serial number that got stolen with it, even the battery I'm unaware of, but of course that information is great to store beforehand. I do know my government registration number, and in this case I'm going to put that in. That may have been when you register with your aviation authority, um, if you had done that at one point, or if it's a commercial case. Now I have already registered this with the local police as well. And I've got the number here as well, so I'm going to put that in. Now the estimated value of the system is about $2,400. I spent $400 on an extra battery. Have posted on Facebook about the uh, stolen item. And of course it came with an extra battery controller and was in a soft case. I have no other comments, so I'm going to click Next. Now, I can use this automated GPS location to find out where the location was, but it wasn't stolen right where I am right now, so I'm going to select Nearby. You type in the city to find the close area, and then we're going to zoom in. And I can actually drag this to the place that I lost it near this park. I can go into as much detail as I want. In fact, I know it was right next to this building. And I can choose the date that it was stolen, and this was yesterday. It's always important to register it as soon as you can of when it occurred. I'm going to click Next, and images are extremely important. So I'm going to add my DJI image here. That will be uploaded, and of course we do want to be notified when someone finds it. So I'm going to put in my name. And I'm going to put in my phone number because I do want to be contacted about this when someone finds it. My company is not relevant here, but I can add my address if I want. And finally, I'm going to agree to the policy. And Now that you can see, my report has been submitted. And I am going to register as well, just so I can view that report. Now I can see my report has been created with the drone. There's a few options I have here and you can see it's got my serial number and the police report ID, as well as the location, the images, and some more information that I provided with the system. Now I can use the share report item to easily share it to my favorite social media places. If I copy that link, for example, you'll see that it will allow me to look at posting very easily. It'll say, check out the stolen drone and it'll provide the link to it. So no more having to post into different forums. Everyone will see the same information here. Now the system will also start crawling different marketplaces with the drone serial number to try and detect if it finds anything in the local areas. If it is detected, it will tell us. And it will also go to drone detection systems, meaning if there is a drone detection system or a counter drone system, it will detect if this drone is flying midair with that serial number. Now I can also come back and mark it as found. 
if someone reports that drone is found, or I can report a sighting as another user. If I go back to the home page, you'll see that my DJI FPV report is here, and I can revisit that at any time. I can also view my drones if I had other lost drones, uh, and come back and report that if I ended up finding it. So in a nutshell, that's how you can report your stolen drones with stolen drone info. And if someone finds your drone online and they enter that serial number into the home page, they're also going to be told it has been stolen. They can then come to that link and report a sighting and they'll go through that sighting process.